Let's make a bet. Let's make a bet. Me and my girl are arguing, okay? Not arguing, but... I say that there's no way that they'll let me give Deloria a deposition because they've already been ordered to do things. Well, I mean, state law said, state law said you can't, uh, you have to turn over certain things by a certain date. State law said you had to do this. They ignored, first of all, they ignored state law, right? And then I went to the first hearing. I was like, hey, they didn't turn over the stuff. The judge was like, all right, guys, you got to turn that over. I'll give you to August 9th to turn it over. Did they turn it over? No. And then I kept saying, hey, you're supposed to turn that over by August 9th. They didn't. Next hearing, August 28th, they fucking said, oh, yeah, we're getting our shit together. We'll let you know. We're still working on the times of our witness. Listen to the hearing from Bloody Conneroo. When he goes, he goes, oh yeah, the state's just getting the times of our witnesses and shit. So you knew who the witnesses were on July, on August 20th. Excuse me, didn't turn, I just pounded a kombucha. It didn't turn them over. Then, damn, I wonder if I can turn this around. But anyways, so show my beautiful and handsome boy modeling school face. But, um, so anyways, they didn't turn them over then. They were like, oh yeah, turn them over. Or they're like, they're working on it. Then they didn't turn them over. Then the judge is like, you have to end of the day to turn them over. And then they get, they sent me a thing. They sent me the thing that they should have sent me four months ago. And the only thing that was on it was the, was the uh, our officer and the two victims, right? So what happened to all these witnesses that they were figuring out what time... They would be available and all this shit. No, 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 no. The cops come when you call them. They get paid. This ain't no, uh. So they knew, they were, they made it seem like they had a bunch of witnesses. And then when I called them on it, they didn't have any witnesses. They sent, but that was actually bad because technically he sent me something. But also technically what he sent me further gives me further evidence to get the case dismissed and have his witnesses disqualified and all that with prejudice because, well, if he gave me a list of people that he's had since uh, May something, you know, why did it take till a court order in September to get it? It's not like he's going to be able to go into court and say, oh, well, we were working on it. You had it that whole time, so you should have just turned it over. So now because I can prove that the witness list it wasn't like he was still finding the new witnesses. He still needed to. I mean, he already had the witnesses, so he could have turned it over. So the state can't go in there and argue and say, oh, we weren't sure who we were going to call. He gave me a list from the officer, of the officers and the victim. So alleged victim, fake victim, wannabe victim. I've never seen somebody work so hard in my life to play the victim when it's not like she gets anything out of it. She don't get, not like, okay, I don't know what Mackenzie gets out of it. Maybe, like, her mom, I don't know. Like I said, she's an undercover uh, uh, Tucson police. And her mom is in a sexual relationship with a Tucson police officer. Or was. And so, I'm not really sure what they're fighting for. Because the state, the worst that could happen is I could get convicted in a $500 fine. I could monetize my YouTube channel and make a whole bunch of money. Like the state could make five hundred dollars off this, and I could use this to to make tons of money, hundreds of thousands of dollars on my. I don't know. Maybe I'm exaggerating. I don't even think you actually make money on YouTube. That's why I haven't monetized my shit. I don't even know about all that. But anyways, the point being is, is what are we doing all this for five hundred dollars maximum? Which I'm gonna win on appeal. I'm gonna appeal it to a higher court. The court's gonna say, oh, you missed this deadline. You didn't file that. You didn't get this. Speedy trial this. Speedy trial that. Procedure that. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, before we even talk about what happened, the cases are over because of all the deadlines procedurally. Due process, it's called. I actually uh, have a lawsuit going somewhere. We'll talk about that in another video because I got a lot of updates on that. But I'm still waiting on them to show me the money. And so uh, we'll see. And so um, 
out here. Brum, brum, brum. Get them, boys. And so, uh, out here, so I got a bat. I don't think he's, they haven't followed the law or the judge's orders yet. Why would they start now? The judge said, give him, give me a deposition. I don't think they're going to give it to me because I think Deloria, the cop himself is going to say, I don't mercy. He's going to, I mean, or he's, I mean, the same guy that said he could beat up 46 people. I mean, he came there to beat me up. A jury is just 12 people too dumb to get out of jury duty. There's a sick 80 series. Bam. About a 94 Land Cruiser 80. If you know, you know. Yeah. Oh, it's coming in here too. I had one of these triple locked. If you know, you know. 95 gold edition. Oh yeah, with the golden sombrero. Anyways, one day, one day I pulled out the. Uh, that's a sick one. one day I pulled out the garbage truck in the snow with a triple locked 80. But anyways, that's off topic. I don't want to act like I am anything other than a crazy. But anyway, so we're out here riding mountain bikes. I don't think. He's going to give me the deposition because he doesn't follow state law. But anyways, I think at some point the cop's going to say, well, I mean, my thing is, is I've been asking for the deposition for four months. If the cop was so cocky, he was just going to walk in the deposition and be like, yeah, I fucking did it, bro. What are you going to do? Arrested you, talk shit, blah, blah, blah. If the cop wasn't worried about getting found out in the deposition, we would already had the deposition. Why would a cop who arrested me be scared to give me an interview when I mean, he stated in his body cam that he had probable cause. He did an investigation. He had reasonable suspicion to drive the house. Da, 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 right? He said everything he was doing was by the book. And he wanted me to teach him how the law works. And so, I mean, in order for me to teach him how the law works, he has to show up to class, right? And that's what I'm saying. I think he was just like trying to act tough on the side of the road. There she goes. It's a sick rig. Dirt bags unite. She's got her mountain bike, her gravel bike, and her, I mean, her XC. The box on the top probably got grandma's 80 series. But, uh, <clears throat> where you at, Deloria? Where you at, Deloria? You can hide or you can give me the interview. I mean, or he'll probably give me the interview and just try to manipulate the outcome of it. You know what I mean? Which is fine too, because he'll just look even worse that way. We all know what, like, you know. And so, yeah, these guys are out here uh, shredding. And so, I believe that he'll, he's either not going to give it to me. She believes that he's going to give it to me. Why wouldn't he? The judge ordered him to. Ah, ha, 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 ha. The judge's orders. That prosecutor ain't worried about that judge's orders or he would have never got to that point. So let's ask the people in the comments. Have you ever shredded the whole enchilada? Have you... No, I'm kidding. Do you think Deloria will allow me to grill him for four hours or not? Or do you think that he put his, he doesn't, or do you think he wrote checks his ash, his mouth wrote checks that his ass can't cash? Or do you think Deloria will put the money where his mouth is? Cause you know what I'm saying? This can only go two ways. They uphold my case to the Arizona Court of Appeals and Supreme Court, and I'm convicted of some misdemeanor and pay a $500 fine, or I am going to civilly win money, and I'm going to end this guy's career, put him on the Brady list. Oh, that's another thing. They still haven't replied to tell me if these cops are on the Brady list. You know what I mean? I mean, I put, I asked that months ago too. 
And so I'm gonna get a court order for that next. A court order to order them to release the fact if these cops are on the Brady list or not. I even asked if the cop of the prosecutor, I asked if Matthew Walker's on the Brady list. He didn't like that, I don't think. That's probably why he didn't respond. But we'll see. But you know, in the meantime, full send, all gas, no brakes. Remember. Be free out on here. Be fucking peaceful. But know this. I live in my mom's basement. I have no I'm kidding. So You gotta be careful what you say because then you'll have people calling you asking you if you're threatening people and judges and shit, but you know that's funny too. I don't think Valoria will show up. Uh let me know in the comments do you think Valoria will show up? You know what? I'm actually gonna go live. At some point. Not right now. I got work to do on my bike. But I just thought of something. I could go live and start talking and people can answer and be like, yo, what's up? <laughs> All right. Let me know in the comments. Do you think, uh, do you think Deloria will give me the deposition? And do you think I should have my next court date on Zoom from a raft in the Colorado River? Let me know. Thank you.